we're back. <laughs> Honestly, I'm filming this before I know if you guys liked the first package roulette, but I'm gonna assume you did. So we're back with another one. Thank you for helping me fuel my online shopping addiction. Shall we get into it? There's more packages this time. 16 of these bad boys. Let's see what's in them. Hey, starting with lucky number 13. Starting with an easy one. I love when they have these little perforated tops. Is that how you say that? Slay. <gasps> Slay, okay. I bought this as an option for Valentine's Day. I have been in my sheer era lately. I really have been enjoying clothing that shows off my bits, but also keeps them tucked in. Do you know what I mean? I like when you can kind of see my TTs through my shirt. I like when you can definitely see my booty through my skirt. So I got this off Amazon. I appreciate the ruching because you can basically decide what the shape is gonna be. And then that's cool, it came with shorts and like a bralette to wear underneath it. I probably won't wear these, but the smell, however, is questionable. I will be trying this on on my fan house. If you guys would like to see that lock set, you know what to do. Let's see what the second package is. Uh, I'm gonna give myself a paper cut doing this series. Nah, that's a nine. That's a nine. Why am I so good at drawing sixes and so bad at drawing nines? Like, look at that. Oh my God. TikTok got me again. Another amazing TikToker that I follow who is a redhead was showing off these products. This is the Clear Brow Gel by Anastasia. Anastasia? My go-to eyeshadow palettes are all Anastasia. So I was like, bet. I feel really amateur when it comes to my eyebrows. I feel like I've got everything else down when it comes to makeup, but my eyebrows are so hit and miss some days. And I thought this would be perfect since I dyed my brows. Package number three. 11. It's that big one right there. Oh, I'm excited to find out what this is. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, slay, okay. So if y'all follow me on Twitter, you know that I recently went to a themed burlesque show where I dressed up as the Mad Hatter. I felt like so bummed because I didn't have like a purse or a themed bag that worked with the costume. And I knew that wasn't gonna be the last time I dressed up as the Mad Hatter because y'all know how I feel about Alice in Wonderland things. So I found this. Hello, 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 this is a purse. This is a purse. You put stuff in the back of the bunny. It's a little Alice in Wonderland white rabbit. I'm so excited. Look at those beautiful little bows. Oh, I'm so stoked. Leg Avenue is the brand, by the way. It's super soft. Oh, 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 okay. See, I'm so excited. The day that I ordered this box of stuff was a day I was feeling particularly low. And I haven't been like indulging in things that I usually indulge in. And I think the way I've been indulging instead has been by ordering packages, which is not healthy, but we're working through it in therapy. Anyway, I saw this TikToker who I follow, who is beautiful, curvy like me. We have like very much the same build. And she always does these cute little outfit of the days where she's like dancing and having a good time. And I saw her have this purse and it's a cross the body purse. Everybody in the comment section was like going nuts trying to figure out where her purse was from. And so I went on a ding dang dive trying to find this purse. And I'm so excited that I found it. First of all, it'll be the perfect dog walking purse because I can put Isley's little poop bags and this tiny thing that dangles from this. And then when it's closed, y'all, this purse looks like almost like a cat. It's like a, a, a perfect shape for like a cat head. So when she put it across her body, it just looked like a cat shaped purse with like a little extra, I don't know, a little extra, I don't know. I just don't usually wear cross the body purses that are like extra functional. <gasps> Stop. It looks so cute with this outfit. Like I could do a monochrome all black outfit with this, are you kidding? It's such a good size too. My phone will fit in it. Yes. Oh, you can also change a chain. Oh no, you could just do this. Wait, hold on. This could be a sleigh. Yep, sleigh. This is my new favorite purse. I'm moving everything to this purse tonight. 
Okay. I got a new mirror. You guys know that I recently turned my extra room into a closet. And so I wanted to turn it like into a decorated closet. I wanna add like little light up vines on the walls. And I saw this mirror and I was like, it's so cute and vintage looking. Came with a little brush. I don't know if I will use that. I might donate that. I'll give that to a friend. Mm, I will say I'm not thrilled with the quality. It's a very kind of shitty plastic. Ooh, but the mirror is good quality. Is it a magnified one? Yes, ew. Don't ever look at yourself on the magnified end. I don't care how much you love yourself and how perfect your skin is, that magnified mirror is not gonna make you feel any better about yourself. Oh my God. Actually, slay. Slay, look at my little pride flag over there. <laughs> the gayest little video you've ever seen, y'all. <laughs> I love it. Okay. I was a little bit nervous because of the quality of like the plastic, but this is honestly incredible. I'm gonna put it in my closet right now. All right, and then I got these knives, y'all. This is actually the brand of knives I already have in my house. I've had them since I moved out of my parents' house the first time, so like, I don't know, like eight years, and they're all pretty dull at this point, and I know I could sharpen them, but like the color scheme doesn't actually match my house, and when I saw these, I was like, this matches my like pastel fruity kitchen. So I got these comes with five knives and they're all pretty pastel colors and they were on sale when I bought them. So I was like, perfect. I don't necessarily recommend these knives for like people who are hardcore cookers, people who really like to be in the kitchen. I don't cut stuff up very often because you guys know me, I'm terrified of knives. So this is like perfect for me because it's not super expensive, but it's good enough quality for the amount of cooking that I do personally. If you guys cook a lot, you should definitely spend the money on a nicer knife set. Next package is number ooh, 12. Didn't I just do 11? <laughs> Honestly, I love that I got this package right after. This was not planned at all, but that's amazing. I kind of wish I had gotten this one, unpacked this one before I unpacked that one, because I bought this one first and saw the other knives and saw that they matched. So I bought them together, like Slay. So I'm gonna have all brand new knives in my kitchen. And these ones have little hearts which actually match something else that you should hopefully see in this video. Although my friend did point out that it's gonna be hard to clean in like these little holes. They ask you how you are, you just have to So I'm not looking forward to that. Um, <laughs> but I love the hearts. I'm trying to get more like heart-shaped things in my home, not just for Valentine's Day, but just in general. Like my house is a horror love dungeon. No, it's just like I like horror. I'm a horror fan and I also love love. So it's like those two things. Moving on. <laughs> I don't know how many packages we've opened so far, but hey, number 16. When I got ready to film this video yesterday, I only had 15 packages, but a 16th one showed up today. So I think I might know what it is. Ah, uh, uh. uh, yeah, yeah. This isn't what I thought it was, but So as I was saying, this is not what I thought it was gonna be, but this is another makeup thing that that TikToker had recommended. This is the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna matchstick. And I think the color should be amber, yes. That TikToker is a ginger like me, and this is what she uses to contour. And I, I don't really contour that much. However, I did contour my nose for the first time ever today for this video. Let me know how I did. Unless you don't think I did good, then don't tell me. <laughs> but I'm going to try this out to add a little bit more contour. I do like the trend of the girls with round faces making their faces look even rounder. So I'm gonna try it. And try it sometime soon. But this just seems relatively easy to use. It's just a cream stick and then you blend it with a little blush pen. So pretty. I am definitely a fan of the branding. Let's do package. I think this is two. Package number two, let's go. Package number two. That's you. Ooh woo. The fuck is this? Okay, so we've got a mystery package that says do not separate on it. Wait, wait, I think I know what it is. Yes, okay. I have been wanting this for like mm, a few months now. 
and the price is basically what's kept me from getting it, but I talked about it in my fan house and in my Discord, and I was like, chat, I really want this. Should I treat myself or should I not do it because it's expensive? And y'all were literally like, bitch, get it, treat yourself. So this is my Valentine's Day present to myself. You're probably seeing this after Valentine's Day because in context to when I'm filming this video, Valentine's Day is in a few days, which also means that I filmed this video and the last video not that far apart, please. My addiction is bad, I'm aware. Look at it! Oh my God, we got the Insta Instax Mini Evo. So I already have the OG Instax camera. I love this thing so much. I haven't used it in a while, mainly because my biggest issue that I've had with this is the fact that you can't see the picture you're taking anywhere except for through this viewfinder. So if I'm ever trying to like take selfies, I just have to guess. You can kind of like see a little reflection, where is it, like here, but it's not always super accurate. The other thing is if you take a picture that's not good, it prints out that picture no matter what, because you took it. So they came out with the same vibe camera, but this one has a digital viewfinder and you can take a bunch of pictures. I think it stores up to 40 without an SD, and then you can choose which ones actually print. But I did a little package deal that comes with an SD card, and it also comes with film, which I actually already have some, but the pictures are usually like this big. They shoot in portrait. Obviously, you can still take pictures any direction you want. But the advantage of being able to take a bunch of pictures and choose which ones you'd like to print is just so top tier, I couldn't pass it up. I literally just did a boudoir shoot for fun with that camera and it was very frustrating because even though we were having fun, it was hard relying and waiting to see if the photos turned out to make sure like every pose that we liked got a good photo, blah, blah, blah. So now we could just rapid fire that shoot and then choose the photos to print. Oh, I'm so excited about that. If you would like to see a YouTube video of me doing a fun little photo shoot that's safe for work with this camera, let me know in the comment section below and I'm super down. I'm just saying, my fan house lock sets have been fire lately. I love this video series so far. It feels like Christmas. And it's also like beating my depression patterns, which is kind of cool. Number 15. Decent size. Let's see what you've got. Let me see what you've got. Twist, 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 mashed potato mambo. Only the real ones know what that is. Y'all remember that sheer dress that I got in package number one? I also got it in black because you know me. Who wears color? Not me. I only wear color on holidays. So this is for any other day. Let me know if you wanna see these. Where's it gonna be? That's right, you're catching on in my fan house lock sets. And you're bearing souffles. And that triple somersault is when I want Miss Baltimore crabs. Number six. Ooh. I think this is the package I'm most excited for in this whole entire haul. I really, really hope that it is what I think it is and that it fits. Everybody cross your fingers for me. Bleak, sleek. This is a little sneak peek. Oh my God, it comes in a little package. Slay. Oh my God, it smells so good. Like it smells like real leather. I don't even know if it is real leather. Okay, these stickers are amazing and I wanna keep them. I saw a dupe of this on Amazon and I was like, bitch, I bet I could do this, get this really nice on Etsy. And that's what I did. I got a harness. I'm gonna take off this belt for a second. Okay, so I got the back on. Can you see it? I hope you can. I think it's honestly just one of those like, you twist it around your body and you figure it out from there. Oh my God. Y'all. Y'all, y'all. Okay, picture the little red lingerie dress from my Victoria's Secret haul, last package roulette, and this on top. And some combat boots. 
is a sleigh. I'm obsessed. It's so cute. It's very comfy. Guys, if you ever see a harness that you like on Amazon, consider looking up that exact same harness on Etsy. You're going to get a better fit for you. You can literally measure your body and ask for it to be made custom. That's what I did. And I'm literally obsessed. And also, nine times out of ten, you'll be helping out smaller artists, smaller companies, smaller stores. And sometimes you get little cute stickers to come with. I'm obsessed. Ah! We're making progress. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight packages left. Well, that means we're halfway done. <laughs> Package number five. This one's heavy. Okay. We've got wrapped up stuff inside of the package. Oh God. Sold as set. Do not separate. What is in here? What are we worried about separating? I have a feeling I didn't mean to order this. I am correct. I definitely didn't mean to do this. Stop. How many of these did I buy? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All the same flavor, and none of them have caffeine. How did I do that on accident? I gotta look up my orders. I need to know because I ordered one of these. I saw this TikTok hack. It's all TikTok, guys. I saw this hack of women that are like closer to their 30s than their 20s going out to bars and drinking vodka and water and putting in a few drops of Mio. And that's how they're staying hydrated and not getting hung over and you know, blah, blah, blah. And they can hang. So I was like, I need that because the way I've been reacting to alcohol lately is not great. And so I've only drank like four times this year so far. So I ordered one of these and it showed up. So that's why I'm especially confused how this happened. You can't see it on my desk, but this is just a little catastrophe on my desk. No, it says pack of 12. It does. I spent $50 on this. Don't order things online at night. And always look at the price. Why did I do that? Oh, I'm actually very frustrated with myself about this. Well, if any of my IRL friends watch this and would like some, they're free. If you live in Austin, hit me up. <laughs> what the hell? I'm so mad right now, hello? Number one. Number one victory royale, yeah, Fortnite about to get down, get down. I'm excited to find out what this package is because it's like flat and it feels weird. It feels like someone freeze dried something and sent it to me. Ooh, this is for my autistic bitches. Oh, I'm excited about this. This is a life hack I've been seeing a lot lately. I've told you guys this somewhere, I don't remember where. But I basically shower if I wanna wash my face now. I hate the act of leaning over my sink, washing my face and the water dripping down my arms. Like it sends me into a spiral. It's so upsetting. So I saw these. Oh, these are small. These are tiny, tiny, tiny. Oh no, they're shedding. We're gonna see how these help so I don't have to shower every time I wanna wash my face. Okay. Brown, pink, white, and pale pink. I don't know, they're kind of small. I don't see how they're going to catch liquid. I maybe should have ordered these off of Etsy instead of Amazon. I probably can still return them. And so I might. <gasps> Number 14. All right, it's a bigger package, but it weighs basically nothing, so. <laughs> Do I want to show this? Um, it's for grooming. It's for maintenance. And then a thing for making freak, freak freckles? Fake freckles. <laughs> this is called Deer Roll Freckles Liquid Air Cushion. I saw this on TikTok too. I got it in the shade chocolate, which is like the lighter shade. And I'm gonna test that out probably on stream. But yeah, the other stuff in here is for grooming. 
and I don't feel like I should show you it. I would love to help educate pussy havers in my following. However, some people will make it weird and I know they will. I've been on YouTube a long time. Ah! I got a favorite cut. Ah, I'm gonna give myself a paper cut doing this series. Number eight. Number eight, you better be fucking worth it because I ain't got a paper cut because of you. <gasps> We've got a workout set. Sports bra with built-in cups and bicycle shorts. That was just something I needed because I ran out of ones that fit. You know, mood stabilizing meds are amazing, but they do force you to buy new clothes because the weight gain happens. <laughs> it happens. <laughs> but you know what? Loving life is worth it. I'm like scared to give myself a paper cut now. Number four. Okay, I know what this is because the package gives it away. But do you guys remember not that long ago when I was like, I got these heart knives because they go with something else I bought. And you'll see it later. Well, Paris Hilton came out with some kitchenware recently. And I thought about buying a bunch of it, but I decided a lot of it's not stuff that I would use on a daily basis. But y'all, I have a caffeine addiction. So I decided to buy my first ever French press. This is one of Paris Hilton's stuff from her new line. All of them are like light pink like this and have pretty little hearts on them. And I just am, I just think that the like heart design is to die for in kitchenware. And I've always wanted a French press. I have no idea how it works. I'll be looking up tutorials. I'll be hitting up my friend Sheebs, who in my opinion is the coffee goddess of the internet. And oh my God, I didn't know. This is the best part. It has a spoon in the shape of a heart. You're literally lying to me. You're literally lying. I absolutely love it here. This is the best thing. If you guys have any recommendations for what kind of coffee I should be putting in this press, let me know in the comment section below. Also, the, the branding literally says that's hot on it. Paris Hilton is a fucking genius and she has played so many people by pretending to not be one. And I love her for that. The original bimbo. Which number is it? 10, seven, or three? Seven. Seven. Lucky number seven. Oh, I'm excited about this. I have become a claw clip girl. And I decided that I need claw clips that aren't just the claw. The claw. I need some with little designs, but they have to be big because you girls got thick hair. So I got a bunch of these Y2K looking flowers and a bunch of colors. Oh, I love this one. This one might be my favorite. I love tortoise shell, but it's like matte. Ugh, I love a matte. I love a matte. Oh my God, stop. It's like a gray brown, no, a browny pink matte. Stop. Matte black. Stop. Hey, 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 hey. Stop. Oh, I'm so stoked. I'm so stoked. Let's see. Is it gonna be able to hold up my mullet? How's it look? Is it a sleigh? Is it a sleigh? I can't believe it's holding up my hair. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Ah! Number three. The order of the way that this roulette is going is so top tier. Cause we got more claw clips. This was definitely from the same rabbit hole that I went on when I purchased these. So this is a pearl claw clip. I'm a little nervous about the material it's made out of. I feel like this is gonna hurt my head. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Is it cute at least? Y'all, I feel like a witch with pointy stiletto nails is digging into my scalp. Might not be a sleigh for me, y'all. Having thick hair is really difficult when it comes to finding stuff to put in your hair because like, if you have the wrong kind of hair tie, like putting your hair up in a ponytail is going to ruin your day. That shit gives me migraines. I'm a little bummed about that. I also, got, there's also this little box within that box. I don't know what this could be. Dika hair accessories. Ooh, oh, these are better. 
These are better. I got more pearly hair clips. So this one is like hard plastic, so it might be better. I love the pearly look. I've been wearing pearl necklaces more often with like my metallic jewelry like around it to make it look like feminine and also masculine at the same time. Give it like an edge, feminine with an edge, right? So I wanted to get a pearl clip like this. This one feels good. This one feels really nice in my hair. Let's try this big pearl one. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, is it a sleigh? I hope you guys are able to see this. Disappointed in this one, but the rest of the claw clips, absolutely worth it. So far, I've only regretted two purchases. Hey, that feels good. No need to take out the last number from the box because the last package is number 10. What is behind door number 10? Oh, <gasps> TikTok one again. This is just, TikTok should sponsor this video, honestly. They never would though. They don't like women. <laughs> anyway, I finally ordered some skims. So first and foremost, bought some panties. I showed you guys that I've been in my sheer era, which means I don't wear thongs underneath, you know, my sheer clothing, my sheer flare pants. Because like, I have a great ass, but it's already massive as it is. So a little bit more coverage makes me feel safer in public. So I got, I think I got two pairs of the high-waisted underwear. Ooh, okay, and I got a little black ribbed tank top. She's ribbed. This is really not gonna cover up much of me because of my tits. I'm gonna have to try this on. Where am I gonna try it on, you ask? So true, so true. You guys are catching on, I'm so proud of you. They're learning. This piece right here is the reason I went over to Skims because I saw another TikToker I follow put this on and she said, this was what I was most worried about. I thought it was gonna be the ugliest thing and it ended up being her favorite thing in the entire haul. It's a faux leather turtleneck, mock turtleneck bodysuit. And ooh, okay, the bodysuit is like soft on the hoo-ha area. It's not the same fabric. It goes all the way, zips all the way up in the back. There's little darts for the TTs. Can you see that? Can you see that? Can you see that? Little darts on the TTs that'll make them look nicer. There's soft padding on the inside so it's not the faux stuff that's touching you. Oh, it's so soft. Oh, I cannot wait to try this on. I'm so excited. That's gonna be so cute. And of course, I had to get the Skims bodycon dress. Everybody's been ranting and raving about it. They do have this dress in other colors, but you guys know me. I prefer my black. This is actually not the fabric I thought it was gonna be. It's like a ribbed knit almost. Okay. I know it's always hard to see the black clothing I show off on these videos in my lighting, but we've got a bodycon dress. I've really been enjoying my little tummy pooch. I think it's really sexy in tight skirts that are high-waisted. So I think I'm gonna think it's really sexy on this too. And I've really been wanting a long dress to put like a big t-shirt, big crop top over to like wear when I'm like casually like shopping, casually at a bar, whatever. So I'm excited to try this on. Guys, that's everything. Yo, should I finish this video standing up? Have I ever finished a YouTube video standing up? <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you guys for um, not judging my addiction to ordering stuff online. This is actually helping me in a way that it is making it very visual to me that I have a problem. <sighs> Capitalism has me in a chokehold and uh, I'd like to work on that. But if you guys like this kind of video, let me know. I'm hoping that in the future, none of these roulette videos will have this many packages, but I am still down to do this as a series because it is fun. It is like Christmas. Let me know if you like the video by leaving a like. If you guys watch the whole video and you're not already subscribed, what the heck are you doing? Consider hitting the sub button and maybe even hitting the bell button so you can get notified when I post new videos. And of course, this isn't the only place I post stuff on. I post stuff on all these social medias and I would love to see you not just here, but there. So let me know. <laughs> I adore you guys so, so much. 
Thank you for watching the video. I will see you guys on the YouTubes later. Let's open some surprise packages together, friends.